in situ testing. Before each flight, check that the system is operating properly. To do so, press and hold the press to test and reset button on the stowage box. After one second, the blinker must turn black. It indicates that there is no leakage in the system. Then press and hold the press to test button on the regulator. While pressing the buttons, the blinker must turn yellow, indicating that oxygen is flowing. Also, check the oxygen noise in your communication headset. It indicates that the microphone is operating correctly. After the test, the blinker must stay black. If it stays yellow, check for leakage in the system. Donning. After any use of a mask, always restow it in its box, even if it may be necessary to use it again in the same flight. Pull the mask completely out of the box. While you are swinging the mask forward, inflate the harness by pressing and holding down the two red tabs. Put the mask on your head. Then release the red tabs to guide the mask onto your face. Finally, close the stowage box doors. The Oxy on flag indicates that the oxygen supply is on. By turning yellow, the blinker indicates that oxygen is flowing to the mask. Regulator functioning. You can switch the regulator to different modes using the dilution rocker and the press to test and emergency rotating knob. These modes are the 100% mode, the normal mode and the emergency mode. 100% mode. During the stowage and the donning, the regulator is set in 100% mode. This mode allows the user to breathe 100% oxygen. To activate the 100% mode, push the dilution rocker upwards. Normal mode. The normal mode must be used when you perform pre-breathing or after emergency descent when diversion altitude is reached. To activate the normal mode, pull the dilution rocker downwards. Emergency mode. In emergency mode, the regulator supplies an oxygen overpressure. It prevents smoke or harmful gases from entering into the mask, allowing you to breathe safely. The protection against smoke and harmful gases is obtained by using smoke goggles combined with the mask regulator. Make sure that you are in the 100% mode. To use the emergency mode, Turn the press to test an emergency rotating knob counterclockwise. Removable goggles. The protection against smoke and harmful gases is obtained by using MXG or MXP smoke goggles combined with the mask regulator. Remove the goggles from their bag. Don and position the goggles onto your face. Open the vent valve by pulling down the vent valve button. Once the emergency event is over, you can close the vent valve and restow the goggles in their bag. Stowage. Make sure that the dilution rocker is pushed upwards in 100% mode. Make sure also to deactivate the emergency mode by rotating the press to test and emergency knob clockwise. Remove the mask by pressing and holding the red tabs. Open the stowage box doors. Fold the harness over the mask shell cavity as shown. Coil the oxygen supply hose into the bottom of the stowage box. Slide the mask into the box until it clicks locked. Close the door, making sure neither the hose nor the harness gets caught. To reset the system, firmly press then release the press to test and reset button on the stowage box. The oxy on flag will disappear. Then press the press to test button on the regulator. Cleaning and sanitizing the mask. Use the Eros San 50 wipe to clean and disinfect the facial seals. Use the Eros San 40 cloth to clean the goggle lens.